Tenet. Emmanuel Cho, KT News. Now, the National Dialogue Committee will resume sittings on Monday to listen to petitions from, among others, political parties and senators. Grace Nganga reports on what exactly to expect from the talks this week. With the hearing submissions almost coming to an end, political parties will be making their pitch Monday, giving recommendations on what to be adapted by the National Dialogue Committee. Kenya Kwanza, Jubilee and the Azimio La Umoja One Kenya Coalition are among the political parties that will be presenting their memoranda. Last week's sessions were dominated with calls to audit the 2022 presidential elections and additional counties since UDA is not willing to engage in that talk. UDA Secretary General Clofas Malala has said they will be recommending for the committee to drop their agenda seeking to audit the 2022 polls as the matter was settled by the Supreme Court. Guzi ambaye liisha, tulimaliza, tukaenda Supreme Court, Rais wa Jamuri ya Kenya ni William Samoy Ruto, na haturudi nyuma, we are not going to open that. So as we present our memorandum tomorrow, that will come out very clear that we are not going back into the trenches to discuss the elections that already were conducted in 2022. For Azimio, however, they are adamant that the committee will address the issues that Azimio Laumoja had with President Ruto's election to presidency, with the calls to audit the results being backed by former IEBC commissioners, famously known as Cherura Four. If we wanted to verify the results that were announced today, if we want to do a verification, is the system that you put in place secure? Is it ver verifiable? Can we open and see what is in those servers? That when we were in Greece, we didn't even know that there were two pilot papers. Pilot paper one of one and pilot paper one of two. And that's why we are saying we should open the servers, including even pilot boxes, because we don't know if all the pilot papers, the two sets were used or not. The parties will also be addressing historical injustices that have condemned some communities to years of marginalization with calls for additional counties. Former Attorney General Getho Moigai in his presentation last week said the constituencies should rather be reduced and a few political positions scrapped as Parliament has too many leaders. According to Moigai, political positions should be reduced by scaling down the number of counties that have forced the government to make excessive expenditures. We should be reducing constituencies, not increasing. Uh, we have too many counties. We should reduce counties, not increase counties. Uh, they are costing us a lot of money and quite a number of them are not viable. To abolish the seat of the woman representative completely, Kuna mzee anaitwa Githo Muigai. Ameanza kuleta madharau. Na hiyo ni kiburi kwa wakenya. Wewe wakati ulikuwa Tony General. Mbona huku fanya mambo ha? Mambo haya. Wachana na sisi, wachana na president, wachana na serikali ya saa hii ielekeze wakenya mahali panafaa. The IEBC selection panel chaired by Dr. Nelson Makanda and senators Nedama Olekina of Narok and Kwambo of Kitui, Tom Ojena of Kisumu and Sam Solcher Gay of Nandi will also be submitting their memoranda. Grace Nga Moving on, prominent figures from the Kenya Kwanzaa leadership